sleep, or a sleep-like process, is well known across the animal kingdom, including very simple animals like jellyfish. The discovery of REM sleep in humans and its association with dreaming in the 1950s was revolutionary for sleep science. REM, or rapid eye movement sleep, is partially defined by 1. an increase in random eye movements while asleep, 2. a rapid increase in brain activity, and 3. a state of bodily paralysis while all of this is going on. REM sleep has since been found across mammals, probably best seen by dog owners, but has also been definitively discovered in birds and possibly reptiles. The presence of REM sleep raises interesting questions about the dream states of animals, also best seen by dog owners. Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Please like and subscribe, it helps me out a lot. Testing sleep states and REM sleep in invertebrates has been difficult. Resting states of insects and spiders are known, however. Eulaborid spiders are known to enter a sleep-like resting state while hanging from silk threads, which can be difficult to wake them from. Jumping spiders enter a similar sleep state as well. They tend to become unresponsive and show a series of random body spasms in their legs and spinnerets. The issue with testing REM without invading an animal's brain is the need for movable eyes. Unlike most mammals, most invertebrates with eyes have fixed lenses and must move their heads in order to change what they're looking at, making it impossible to check for a rapid eye movements. However, jumping spiders, being extremely dependent on their vision to hunt and jump from place to place, have unique eyes. Jumping spiders have a set of eight lenses which function as their eyes. Six of them are fixed, but their two primary eyes have movable parts. While they can't move the actual lenses, they can move their retina in order to change what they are looking at without moving their heads. In 2022, scientists collected a bunch of baby jumping spiders and filmed their retinal movements using infrared cameras and a trained neural network to gauge the scope and frequency of those movements. They found that the spiders entered consistent and repeatable REM-like states through the night, in which their retinae moved in random bouts, and their spasmatic body twitching lined up with these REM-like states. I call these REM-like because brain activity was not monitored in these tiny spiders to definitively show a REM state. The number and intensity of these REM states was the equivalent of similar states found in mice and rats. The presence of these states also raises the possibility of visual dreams in jumping spiders. Similar to humans and unlike many other spiders, jumping spiders are extremely visually oriented. So do spiders dream? If so, what are they dreaming about? What is the purpose of dreams in such animals? Is the universe just an unknowable nightmare sustained by the predatory dreams of trillions of spiders? These are the serious questions. If this is REM sleep in spiders, in order for REM sleep to be present in animals so different as humans and spiders, either the origin of REM sleep lies deep in the evolutionary past and has been conserved over millions of years, or perhaps, more excitingly, REM sleep has evolved separately multiple times, indicating a serious evolutionary benefit for such a process, especially at the cost of being almost entirely helpless during this state. 